from Robin Hood to a robot dog. One was Sherwood Forest's past and the other set to be part of its future. Today we saw a trial of some of the highlights of the £10 million part government-funded research project to turn the area into what's believed to be the world's first 5G connected forest. It's going to uh, draw the attention onto, onto Nottinghamshire, which has got to be a good thing for investment, inward investment, and, and people looking at, oh, crikey, technology's there, how can we engage with them? Once the 5G internet signal is up and running, it's hoped its potential can be used to help local businesses grow. Meanwhile, drones and robot dogs will be used to help with environmental protection research and augmented reality headsets showing an interactive holographic film will be available for visitors to hire as part of the tourism experience. With the robot dog, we can equip the dog with the camera and the camera can capture this data automatically. So with that data capture, we can send the data to the internet without having a lot of issue. We expect the 5G to be 10 times faster than 4G. There's certainly plenty of excitement about this project, maybe too much excitement. This will bring in billions. We've got to want billions? Point, I think billions. You eventually, think this will bring in billions I of think, pounds? I think eventually it will bring in billions. And the reason I say that, at the moment, tourism in, in Nottinghamshire is £1.9 billion. Pound. Yeah, and that's as, as it is now. This is the sort of thing, Sherwood Forest, world renowned, is going to bring people in, they're going to see what's going on here and they're going to want to do it. So I think it'd be billions, I'm always an optimistic person, probably in the millions. Naftesh Johal, BBC East Midlands Today, Rufford Abbey Country Park.